Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Chris, and um, today I'm going to be doing a time lapse, I guess, of making a Kydex press. Um, the materials I'm going to be using today are going to be the uh, the foam that the uh, the school sent me. So this is going to be the Kydex press foam that I'm going to be using. Um, I'm also going to be using some three quarter inch plywood, a two by four, and screws and some and a, a couple of hinges uh other than that that's what i'm going to be doing today i'm a little crunch for time um i've been it's my day off and i've been doing a lot of stuff today um it's getting hot today so like 63 degrees in the beginning of january something ain't right but anyways uh, i'm gonna be go ahead and get started on this video i uh, hope y'all enjoy it um other than that, we'll get to it. Thanks. All right, guys, we're back. And basically what I've done, uh, instead of doing the video because I've got a whole bunch of other stuff going on and I didn't have time to set everything up. But basically what I've done is I've went ahead and cut everything that I need for my project. Um, and, and what I've done is I've got... Let me get everything set up here. So I've got three pieces of three quarter inch plywood. That is, uh, one of them is eight inches by, I think 16 inches. One of them is eight by 12 and one of them is like eight by four or eight by three and a half. Um, basically, I also have a uh, two by four that is cut uh, eight inches. And I also have two pieces of foam padding, eight inches by 12 inches. All of this will combine to make the uh, Kydex press. And guys, you can pick up this lumber for like next to nothing. Uh, it's not it's not a very expensive build. So I'm looking forward to it. Uh, some of the other things that I'm going to be using are uh, strap hinges. And uh, let's see here clamps i actually just went to tractor supply i picked these up for like 15 bucks for two of them um, they were on sale you can't beat that uh the other things is i've got like little fasteners little screws and bolts uh oh yeah so i had to go and get the loctite spray adhesive for heat uh this is the most expensive thing of the build. It's like 10 bucks at Walmart. Um, other things like, you know, wood glue. I got that from Walmart. They had them in a, in a kit, uh, after Christmas sale for like seven bucks. So I ended up getting two different kinds. Throw it in the floor. It'll be all right. Anyways, let's get to it. Uh, basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to glue let me walk you through what I'm going to do here. So the basic principle of this is long flat piece, two by four, smaller piece, the two pads, then the um, 8 by 12 and then whenever you put the hinges on it you'll be able to clamp this down um, with these clamps let me see if I can do it <laughs> basically you clamp it down and it holds the kydex around your uh, pistol or knife or whatever you're making the, the, um, the mold for um, or the whatever you're making out of Kydex. So I'm really looking forward to getting this stuff started. Um, I'm not going to do a video on how to do it, but I am going to put some pictures of the process and how I'm doing it. And I may add a video or two. I don't know. I'll be. I know that I'll be back after um, after I get it all done, and I'll show you the completed project or the completed product and. Uh, and go from there. Uh, as y'all can tell, I'm tired. 
I'm wore out. Um, but it's all part of the fun. So I will see you all in just a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and get everything set up, get everything done, and take some co a couple of pictures while I'm at it. And then we'll pick up where we left off. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, so basically, I've got everything done. Uh, I'm gonna post some video or some pictures um, of the process that I was doing. And uh, but basically, here it is. <clears throat> this is gonna be my Kydex uh, press. Um, I've got it compressed right now because I'm I'm letting the glue dry that's holding the uh, the foam pads on. So as you can see. I did the three quarter, um, two by four and three quarter piece and then put them together. So it opens with those hinges. Um, I'm really looking forward to seeing how that works um, and seeing how that, how the Kydex works. Um, as you all know, I, I, had, <laughs> I had a run in with, uh, with the We The People holsters and they claimed it was Kydex. I don't, Honestly, I don't think it is, but you know, there's a couple of different kinds of Kydex out there and that's nothing like what I've felt before. But anyways, basically what I've done is created a small at-home press um, for the uh, for the course that I'm taking with SDI. And uh, I think it turned out pretty good. Uh, there's a little bit of a like a like it's not lining up just right on the on the on the edge you know <laughs> I was tired whenever I did this so it, it, it may very well be um, off a little bit but I'm gonna I'm gonna end up trimming a little bit of the uh, the foam off uh, whenever it dries uh, I've got to let everything dry for 24 hours and hopefully whenever I come out here it won't be glued together but this should be all right. Uh, the stuff that I used to glue it together with was the the Loctite adhesive 300 um, is for water and heat. Yeah, water and heat resistant. And it definitely sprays a web. It says right there. Uh, it says web. It does. Take that for don't don't underestimate that stuff. It's pretty pretty wicked but other than that that's all I've really got um, I've still yet to find a box that I'm gonna do for the unboxing um, Taylor should have her glam bag soon um, we're still looking for one for Kim as well um, I don't know if we're gonna get one and get it started this month well I know we're not gonna get it this month maybe I don't know if we're gonna get it even next month because um, I'm trying I'm, I'm trying to purchase a truck right now so we'll see what happens there as well but anyways that's really all I've got for you all guys uh, make sure that you f uh, remember to like uh, comment and subscribe make sure that you hit that little bell down there at the bottom that way you get notified anytime that we put out a video anytime that you know either myself my wife Kim or my daughter Taylor puts out a video guys we just have fun with this um, I've thought about sending letters to people and saying, hey, you know, I'll put a video out for, you know, for your stuff if you send me free stuff. And I don't know. I don't, I don't, I can't, I don't think I should, I can't bring myself to send that email yet. Uh, but anyways, guys, that's all I've got uh, right now. If y'all have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Um, I will be doing a video on the Kydex. Uh, whenever I go to make the holster, um, here's the box that the, that the school sent me with all the fun stuff in it. Um, this has got all kinds of fun stuff in it. Fasteners and belt straps and um, a punch to, to set the brads with and 
Looks like uh, straps. But yeah, it's gonna be fun. And here is, there's that piece of Kydex that I was talking about. So I'm looking forward to this. I know it's got uh, sawdust on it, but I'm gonna clean that up. I'm really looking forward to the to the Kydex lab that I'm doing. Um, because one, I need a holster. <laughs> and two, I'm, I like doing stuff like this, guys. Uh, anyways, I'm rambling at this point. I'm so tired. So, yeah, it's almost my bedtime, which is like, it's 7.15. Anyways, guys, appreciate y'all watching the video. Appreciate y'all sticking with, with us for this long. Um, I think we're up to, I think, 61 subscribers, maybe. 51, 61, something like that. I'm happy. We're, you know, we're really getting a few subscribers out there. So make sure that you share this video with your friends, you know, share the other videos with your friends. If you see a video that, you know, you'd like to see more of, like the AR build, I would love to do more of those. Um, I am going to do a video on the 5D. Ooh, let me get it. On the 5D tactical stuff, um, I cannot wait to do this video. I'm looking forward to doing this video uh, because I have an 80% lower that I'm wanting to do and show the world how easy it can be done. I'm trying to keep this uh, this channel non-politically based or biased, I should say. But as you all can tell, I like my um, I like my firearms. Anyway, I'm gonna leave on that note. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell that way you get notified. And on that note, I will see you all later. Bye, everybody.